Hey there, Mirni here. I've been wearing wigs since 2018. Today I'm gonna to talk to you how I achieve a natural looking hairline. The most important factor in achieving a natural hairline is proper sizing. Getting measured is key to having a natural looking hairline. Whether you're measuring yourself or working with a stylist or consultant, sizing matters. A unique service that Daniel Elaine offers is having a fit kit sent to you. With the fit kit, you're able to try on different cap sizes and actually wear them around in your normal life. And you will determine what fits you the best, what's the most comfortable, and if it's the right size for you. If your cap is too big, your lace front will lift up or slide back. If your cap is too small, you might actually stretch out your cap and eventually fray the lace front. With proper sizing, your hairline is gonna look natural and beautiful. It's gonna lie flat because of a thing called circumference tension. This will just snug your head perfectly and there shouldn't be any lifting if your wig fits you properly. I like to add a little bit of Stronghold free spray to my front hairline just for extra security. This is just a little trick that I have and it just gives me the comfort of knowing that my wig is not gonna come off by a simple tug by my children or if I'm doing anything that's super aggressive like going out dancing. At the end of the day, to remove the Stronghold hairspray, you simply use the ear tabs and the wig will simply just lift up without issue. After about six wears, you start to notice a little bit of buildup from makeup and hairspray residue, but it comes off super easy with shampoo when you're doing your regular maintenance. One final tip is to remember that your lace front is your most delicate part of your wig. So do your best to only handle your piece through your ear tabs. So those are my tips on achieving a natural looking hairline. If you want more information on the wig that I'm wearing today, check out danielelaine.com. And if you have any comments or questions, leave them below.